What's up, ladies and gentlemen? How are you doing today? We are your hosts. I am Lionheart. Duck Girl. And we are the, the Apex. Apex. Always here to do another question as to what if, and that's what we're doing, right? We're watching another episode of the series What If Season 2. Oh, you know what? I shouldn't even put two fingers because that makes it four. Season 2, okay? Uh, you know what? you have anything to say? I can't wait what if. It could be something to deal with in the past. Maybe Pocahontas will be in the in this episode. Oh my god, they mix Disney characters into the what if. Actually, let's hear what this title is. This title is called... Holy crap, what does it call? It says, what if Iron Man crashed into the Grand Master? Which we know Grand Master was the one we <laughs> saw in um, Thor Ragnarok. Okay, I'll make a prediction. So basically... Iron Man went to the planet of Sakaar. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking too. I don't know. I feel like... Wait. <laughs> if Iron Man went to the planet of Sakaar, Which, well, that means he's going to meet the rock guy. The Valkyrie woman. Valkyrie, yeah. Wait, does that mean the story would change with Thanos as well? That's the thing. We don't know. Every timeline has a different outcome and story. So, and the the other question is, what happens when we get near the end of the the end of the season? Will it do what it did last season, which is the timelines merger for the threat? That's what I want to know. So you see, there's so many questions. Well, to know. if if I know the watching of many multiverse show and everything, there's always something in the end of dealing with the timeline. Yeah, <laughs> but besides that, we're gonna get started with this. So let's get to it. Hold on, I'm gonna sit up a little bit because I want to make sure you're properly like shut. Yeah, because I want to make sure you got your height, my guy. And five, four, three, two, one. Let's go to Sakar. Yeah, that was from last season. Strange Supreme. Okay, so we're looking at Gamora's story that we saw in season one. It's true, we didn't get much of a background. She got recruited. So they're basically going to be between so Gamora and Iron Man then. See, Tessa Thompson, Valkyrie is in here. Taka Watati, the rock dude. I don't know who Rachel House is, but... Josh Brolin! That's Thanos. That means Thanos is in this fucking thing. So I may be right. No, no, I think you were right, exactly. What if? Yo, we been getting better! Shoot, we got better worth our time in. 2012. Oh, wow. Ooh! Yeah, but he had lost his breath when, he, when this happened, though. <clears throat> Remember, during the time that he fell, he had lost his breath a little bit. Yeah, but remember, the iron should give him oxygen. The Grandmaster. Porcelana? That is overkill. Sakaar! <laughs> Uh, of Thanos. Who? Oh, the so they have heard of him. A different timeline. Rocket Man. I remember that yeah. movie. Oh, because they thought that the Iron Man died. Yeah, that's. <laughs> Wait, would Hulk be in here too? No? No, remember, Sakar, Sik Hulk was there. After the war, after Iron Man and the uh, city and all that, that's Ultron. when Hulk disappeared. It's right after Ultron. Mm hmm. So then, would there be any champion for the, for the grand? Oh! What oh! The Damn, you gotta scream that loud? Hey, Valkyria! I believe there's no more killing people. It's all racing. <laughs> yeah, dude, this could be death race if they do the Coliseum like that. And Valkyrie's a driver. 
Just let them go. They like to taunt them. Hey. Are you bidding? Yeah, I need a case to to keep my stuff. See? Jesus. Where's the horse? Exactly. That is like NASCAR. Damn. I'm telling you, that's a death race right there. I it, re it represent one of the movie. Yeah, because it's like whatever's the last one standing would be the winner out of that whole circle. Why drive backwards? That's Mater. What the fuck is that? Oh. I say it's death race. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought you were doubting it though. Oh, nice. She used it as a ramp. Oh, okay, okay. Are you really throwing tin cans? What the fuck are they throwing? I'm chinchilla. You're right, it doesn't look like a chinchilla. Oh, elephant! Okay. Oh my god, it's got Flip Flintstone! I was gonna say the same. Oh. <laughs> Did you hear that? Yeah, I'm trying to figure that out. You think it's because of that stuff that sprayed on him? Yeah. Did he kill it? No, nothing came out of that. Gamora. Probably, yeah. Whoa, what the fuck? Why is she trying to shoot him? Thanos. Oh. Remember, he went to the car. Dan, he oh. didn't went to Earth. Damn it, Valk. Oh no. You're right, you're right. I'm sorry. Oh shit! What the fuck? Hey! That's cool. No mind control. It's not a mind control. It's a. It's meant to keep them in restraints. Yeah. The one burden to bring balance to this. <laughs> so tell me about this grandmaster. Still not a signal. Oh no, it's doing it again. Did you think it was a signal in the jail? Oh shit, she, she got the weapon. She's gonna cut you again. What you got to pick this song? No! Thanks for the exit. Wait, but this is the Gamora that it would help the multiverse, so it still doesn't. Maybe after this event. And don't forget, she's the one who killed him. I think after this event happened. Remember they say, you will know what happened to Kermora before she came and saved the multiverse from season one. Yeah. <laughs> what exactly was that that he had? A bomb. Yeah, but connected to what though? Knowing Tony Stark, he could do anything he wants. Hell yeah, man! That's exactly right. That's a good question. How did she get out? She has Bruce Trey. She broke the door. Remember she broke the glass? She is strong. She's not like a normal person. Iron Man. Wow. Your mother the other one is. Yeah, it's a really interesting farm. They put you in the street. You see the animation's different on the chinchilla? Yeah. And then they put this cool dome thing to spot where your head is. Definitely no one does. The bottle of the sewer water. This is demon rum. Top shelf. Tell me any given me life advice, Cote. Wow. Name's hurt. So there's pooping on me. I do not like it. And he will not stop. Because what he beat the Grandmaster at his own game. What do you say? Top 
Damn. Human. That must be a strong alcohol. <laughs> yeah, that a human can constitute in their body is enough. Damn! Oh. Yo, we were thinking the same. Again, we're going back to Iron Man building out of nothing. You know what I'm thinking when I see that? Iron Man! And Iron Man! Iron Man! Iron Man from the 90s. Yeah, class. I like that song. See, the Grandmaster's now kissing her ass. You are an excellent murderess. I want Tony Stark. Who? Hello, man. Oh, blasty hands. He left, but not a master genius like me. Um, are you sure about that? He's too cocky. Intrigued, but not sold. You pick the chariots. Now you know exactly where he'll be. Why the hell does he? More importantly, why didn't you take that out of your neck? Sure, I'll stick to that story too. Wait, so he doesn't believe her then? He's stupid. He really doesn't <laughs> know. It... Thank you for indulging me, guys. I always wanted to walk very slow. Oh my god, are you kidding me? It's like that in the movie. No, but Korg, but I thought it really was slow motion. I'm like, Korg asked for that. He's always playing with everything. Wait, how is he able to do this? Oh, it's cheated. All right. Cheater. Because he's him, he had a head start. He's using the. That's why I thought it was impossible for him to do that. Yeah! Oh! Wow, his body really can break that steel. And the chinchilla is there. <laughs> oh, that, that's now become his pet now. Oh! Man, she's got that melting stick right into the front of the car, so she's gonna melt any car that gets that touches it. Oh! I feel like I'm watching this from another show, from another anime. I don't know any other anime that resembles this. There's a lot of anime that resemble this. Holy shit! Whoa! That's like a roller coaster hill down. Oh, oh, it also looked like the the anime Hot Wheel too. Oh shit, that's a good point. That's a good one. But there's another one too. <laughs> Jesus, that is the most boring form of excitement. Wow! You see all these cars down? Transformer Race World There's from the Transformer Energon or something. You think so? When oh. they have a place to. Oh! Oh shit, he lost <laughs> the chariot. It's Iron Man. He ain't losing nothing. Oh! What the hell? Whoa! Whoa! What the fuck? It's Iron Man! Iron Car, too. Ah, uh, yo, that was G, man. Oh, oh, oh shit! That's true. You did. You mean Mr. Metal Mojo? Oh, I see that sticking. <laughs> I am never gonna call that Metal Mojo. Mr. Metal Mojo? That's like a porn star name. Wait, what? 
Yes, he saw a statue of himself with a thumbs no, up. No, so it, it just winked him. The statue just winked him no, back. No, it's the. I don't think it blinked. I think it was the glare of the sun. Ah. Uh. Come on, use the missiles that fire at these things. Yeah! Oh shit. Good sacrifice. That's just messed up. They're gonna cave them in? How many buttons have he used so far? Oh, damn. Well, that one's down. That means there's only two left. That's why I say, it oh. reminds me of a lot of anime. Okay, I was about to say. Okay, he's ahead. Is there a finish line? Oh, that is a finish line, right? Yep. Careful, he might have something up his sleeve. I was right. Whoa, you know what that is? That's some Fast and the Furious speed right there. Boost! first yo that was some fast and the furious shit like right at the last minute be like bam give that man an applause because that was smooth as shit oh. the eraser <laughs> yeah take that melting stick I'm melting wizard of oz yeah i got that smells like bad life choices <laughs> Bad life choices. I like that. Valkyrie! Valkyrie! Wait, wait. Valkyrie! Tony's the one who won. She killed a guy. Because it landed. It's not like she took the stick and did it. It was like... You know Tony listen. ain't gonna stay in that planet. Tony's saying, ah, you take order of this planet. <laughs> Fuck. What the fuck? It's knowing someone has your back in a fight. So yeah! I'm melting! So this is how he met his end. Alright. Mute that for a minute. Okay guys, so we had just finished watching the fourth episode, which is basically like watching Ragnarok and Death Race, but instead of Thor, we got Iron Man. Iron Man, no Thor, no Hulk. Sorry, let me forget. No Hulk. Forgot that. But and no fighting. But it's just race. Yeah, but technically, I mean, wouldn't you technically say there was sort of a fight in a way? Maybe it's not like the Coliseum Gladiator type of way, but it was kind of similar. People did kind of die the way how <laughs> things exploded and shit. Wasn't that I'm melting! I will say this. I was a little. I did not expect the melting stick to be the factor that would end the Grandmaster. I didn't know that. I mean, did you think he would lose like that? First of all, he is a sore loser. How the fuck are you going to say, Oh, I deem this a tie, and because I vote for me, I'm like, I'll pick me as the winner. I'm like, bullshit! You didn't win nothing but these nuts, bitch! Fuck out of here. Sorry, I don't mean to be vulgar about that right there. I'm fine. Yo, but now we kind of see how is it Gamora became who she is, you know? She melted Thanos into a grape juice. Honestly, I didn't expect her to... For Thanos to meet his end through the melting stick. Man, that thing is really a dangerous factor. Especially in the hands of Gamora. Oh my god. But she didn't use that stick through the during the first season. She took the blade that Thanos had. Yep. Oh man, which by the way, that blade is able to destroy a... Uh, whatchamacallit? Oh my god, what the fuck is the brand called again? Uh, Iron Man, I'm sorry, Tony. I'm s Captain America Shield. Yeah, Vibrarian. Yeah, that sword is so powerful that it can destroy Captain America's shield, which is made out of vibranium, which is a big deal. Of course, it took a lot of strikes, but that's a, a sword of that caliber is a big deal. So I can understand why she kept that. Um, I don't have any other comments. I just thought this episode was good. I thought Tony had a lot of swag. I liked the transition. I liked that his armor resembled, like, 
like the way we saw Thor when he had his thing resemble <laughs> Ragnarok. So we got the same thing, but an Iron Man suit. Yeah, and I like how it represents Speed Racer and other other anime that deal with racing. I we I literally forgot about Speed Racer, and I'm glad that he actually said that. It also reminds me of Star War One. Well, I think Tony's chair. I think Tony's chariot reminds it of uh, Anakin Skywalker's one, right? No, one of the alien, not Anakin. Anakin had no, no. two, two but, and a single. But the but the way it was is like with the rope and everything. Even if it's just one wheel, it had that resemble almost. Yeah. But there there was another rider that had the big wheel and stand on the chariot to go. So basically, a combination of Death Race, um, Star Wars, The Phantom Menace race. And uh, Speed Racer, basically those three. And other anime, other anime what racing stuff like Hot Wheel anime racing, going up and going down. <sighs> There's a lot of reference in that one, yeah. that one episode with a yeah. lot of race reference. What? Because of the way the the landscape was looking <laughs> like? I mean, maybe the landscape, but I'm just. If saying you watch like... Hot Wheel anime, the racing, you will see that they. Wait, wait, you tra- telling me Hot Wheels has a fucking anime? Yeah. What the fuck are you serious? Yeah. Jesus Christ. You see the shit that I sometimes may not know and everything? I'm like, God, I don't even know how the fuck you get all this information, bro. I uh, I watch a lot of stuff. You watch a lot of uh, pop culture anime and like uh, things like that. I mean, me, I got to keep they're watching. They're even a race that you race on dragons. Yeah, that, that I... And spiders. That, that I'm aware of. Uh, but that's it, guys. We're doing that because we have more episodes we got to do. That was our quick summary. I enjoyed the episode. What what, what what would you rate it? Would you say it's a good, really good episode in your opinion? I rate it into 8.5. Oh, you really you actually gave us a rating. I thought you were just going to say verbally the words. See? He likes it. So, yeah. If that's the case. And then our next episode we got to get to is... Ooh, okay. That is not it. It is called, What If Captain Carter Fought the Hydra Stomper? That is our next episode going forward. So so basically, it's going to be the future. Captain Carter go to the future. I believe so, yeah. I believe it. I think it is. We'll find out when we get to that episode. But besides that, guys, we got to go. We don't, need, we don't need to use the prop, okay? At this point, it's like we're in a rush. Right? You we sh- beat you all, dude. Wait, wait. Goodbye. Sh- hey, 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 hey. <laughs> First of all, if you're going to leave us, if we're going to leave you guys, we're going to say this, okay? Show support to us. Art to the channel. Hit that subscribe button below. Hit that bell for the notifications, okay? And I'm not triggering it to hit the bell. You gotta hit the bell by hitting that, all right? That way you can look at our faces so that we can entertain you guys because, I mean, seriously, we were really fanning out a little bit with the references and shit, you know? There was a lot of reference. Besides that, we gotta bid you guys adieu. So all I can really say is. La, 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 la. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. A goodbye. Mwah, and a good night. Bang! <laughs> I need some other fucking views.